Good morning. It is Monday, April 6th. I hope you had a good weekend. Um, I'm going to let you know what's going on today. <clears throat> Your joints quiz and lab and all that were due yesterday. Um, today you're starting on the muscles lab. It's uh, the muscles chapter. It's a difficult chapter. Um, I suggest coming in for tutoring this week. Uh, this week, tutoring office hours are Tuesday at 10 a.m. and Friday at 2 p.m. So you have different links for each one of those sessions. So you click here for tomorrow at 10 and you click down here for Friday at 2. Um, so this week's um, information, um, your test on this chapter opens April 10th and is due the 12th. There are two labs to complete invisible body. The first lab is skeletal muscle tissue due the 9th and the second is a group of activities and we'll look at those activities. That, that second lab is due the 13th at midnight. There's also a lab sheet in course resources that has all of the muscles that you need to memorize. Uh, your lab exam, not really exam, quiz will consist of identifying these muscles, the action of the muscle like extension, and what body part is moving. And this lab quiz will be due the 13th. If your com computer connection makes it, it difficult for you to use visible body, you may complete all of the muscle labs and then you would submit them to a link below. Um, when you do those, if you do the lab manuals, you have to answer all the questions, draw required pictures, and complete the lab review sheet. If you're taking pictures of the lab and emailing me, make sure that I can read your writing. Use a pen to darken it. Um, that will help, you, help me. And this is due the 13th, and you're going to post those in order in the link below. So this week, you want to complete the skeletal muscle tissue lab by the 9th, the second part um, by the 13th, take the muscle ID quiz by the 13th, midnight 13th, complete mastering and quiz by the 12th, and take the test on the, by the 12th. So let's look over here at our online assignments, and these are due the 12th. I definitely suggest using all of the resources in um, Rams online to help you with muscles. As I said, it's kind of a difficult chapter and um, I would use your dynamic study modules. Um, I would be doing those if at all possible, if you have the time. Now here we go over to visible body. In visible body, you can see um, skeletal muscle tissues and that is due the ninth. Okay. So we're going to go into that, look at that a little bit. Oops. So um, when it has a 13 here without any numbers past the decimal, it means the whole chapter. And this means it will really, really help you with the muscle chapter to go through this chapter on visible body. So let's wait a second for that to open up. It takes a while for it to open up here. Um, maybe longer for you, depending on your internet connection. Always try it at a different time of day. Sometimes the internet just is real busy at particular times of day. Um, imagine the entire country has gone online now. So I can imagine it gets a little slow. Still waiting. I hope you guys had a good weekend. I did. The weather was lovely. Did some gardening. Played some pickleball. Did a lot of work, of course. Okay. So here we are. Um, and you, you're going to see these icons over to the right. So... Um, here's our joints. You probably are pretty familiar with this at this point. Um, this muscle types here is going to show a 3D model. And I just want to point out that when you have a 3D model, you come over here to the left and those numbers, those letters and those terms in red, 
you click on one term and it will show you the system skeletal muscle smooth muscle and cardiac muscle okay now you can use your right and left arrows to turn this around some and you can flip it up and down so you can really manipulate your models and then you can go up here and click on that book icon and you can read about the different layers um, so i did want to point that out in the visible body how you can ma manipulate through um, also it may be difficult for you to see what you've completed and not completed go to the calendar and those that you have not completed are in red when i go to gradebook i can clearly see what you have and haven't completed if you want me to have a uh, session with you about your scores in there and whether you you know what you've done what you haven't done i can certainly do that so your visible body um, consists of those different labs now the first one is skeletal muscle tissue and that's due the ninth the second one consists of these four here lower limb upper limb thoracic abdominal head and neck and these are due the 13th um, in addition over here in course resources are the muscles that you need to memorize so you want to look at that and those are the muscles you need to know it will be a powerpoint quiz or a quiz in the rams online like powerpoint and um, you'll be identifying 20 of those muscles so if you have any questions about what's going on this week let me know um, you know how to get in touch with me at this point um, i would say if you haven't looked at some of these things you need to start looking at these these help you with the chapter um, here's the muscles list again here's a muscle activity you can cut and tape these on somebody you know um, your dog your fish whatever and there's just lots to help you here in class so keep me posted on how you're doing i need to hear from you in order to keep you in the class have a good week